morning time. Morning time in Ohio. Oh, I just woke up. Diesel is very anxious to get to that grass over there. Oh, Diesel, there's a sign there that says, do not spray. You better not spray that. Let's go, let's, what does that mean? Do not spray. Do not spray what? Yeah, you spray that. Yeah, good boy, Diesel. Oh, man, just trying to wake up here. Literally just like got dressed, got out of the truck. Brought the weasel out for his weasel business. And I got to fall asleep to the sounds of that highway. Which for me is a great thing because I love that sound. That sound right there? Oh, that is the best sound in the world. Hey, Diesel. Hey, Diesel, look at all the flowers. What a pretty grass area, eh? <laughs> Oh, they smell so nice, man. Yeah, does the tree smell nice? Not anymore. Not anymore. Okay, guys, so we're in Ohio today. We're headed up towards Saskatchewan, which means I'm hoping to make it past Chicago, but I haven't really looked at the map or anything yet. I know we're going through Chicago eventually, but uh, we'll see how far we make it today. Uh, still not in any big rush because our appointment is for Monday at 7 p.m. Today is Friday. And we'll probably end up getting there like Saturday night <laughs> or Sunday, Sunday afternoon. Oh, I'll probably get there Sunday afternoon. We'll see. Hi, Diesel. Hi, Diesel. Not in that big a rush, but we'll see. Maybe dispatch will want me to route back through Manitoba. I, I doubt it because they've already sent me through uh, North Portal, Saskatchewan, which is the border crossing uh, from North Dakota into Saskatchewan. Anyways, I'm rambling. I need to wake myself up before I talk to you guys. <laughs> I'm not making any sense. Okay, I'll talk to you in a bit. Woo! Okay, here we are. We're starting our new day. Gotta get our seatbelt to work properly here. There we go. That always helps. Seatbelts are important. Please look at on your seat. It's almost time to go. Or on the bed. Whatever you want to do. I don't care. Just go lay down. Okay. Pre-trip has been done. Truck's been warmed up. Didn't take too long. It's summertime. And wait a second. No, tomorrow for me is the first day of summer, June 21st. Yeah! I love summertime. Okay, now that I'm all excited, release the brakes, turn the lights on, steering wheel seat is comfortable and adjusted. It's time to hit the road, people. Are you excited? the Ohio Turnpike. Let me aim you guys probably so you can see me better. Yeah, alright. We're looking good. We're feeling good. Let's go. Put her in gear. There you go. Okay, now we just gotta wait for these suckers to go. There you go. Alright, do the pull test. Go forward and pull. Oh, oh, yep, still attached. Still attached. Good. Okay, time to go. We're not gonna lose our trailer on the highway. That's, that always helps. It's embarrassing if you lose your trailer. I wouldn't know, but I could, I know it'd be embarrassing. Good morning, Mandy. We are moving again. Merging onto the freeway I-80 westbound in Ohio. Here's the turnpike, so you gotta pay to drive on it. It is a toll road, but that is why we had that fancy service area to spend the night at. I really think they should have made that on-ramp a little longer so we could hit highway speed before we had to get in the lane, but. If I was part of the planners for that place, that would have happened. Somebody miscalculated the amount of space we need to get to highway speed. Oh well. Okay, onward! We're very close to Cleveland. Very close to Cleveland. Alright, so we just exited the turnpike, the freeway. I believe we're right at the edge of Ohio and Indiana. We might even be in Indiana already. Turn right on Highway 49. But as, as you heard, we're turning on to Highway 49 because we have uh, asked Mandy to take us to the nearest Walmart. It's Walmart time, guys. We haven't been to Walmart in a while. 
so interesting. Freeway is right over to our left. I can see it. It's like a quarter mile to my left. Isn't it interesting how we just barely go off the freeway and it's so different right away, eh? Like there's little farmers here, little narrow road. Such a different atmosphere right away. Like boom, small town America. I love it. I love these little roads. You know, if I had time and money for all the extra fuel it takes to go down these roads, oh, I take these roads all the time. But it takes so much more fuel because you gotta, you know, stop and go and stop and go, slow down, speed up, slow down, speed up. That uses a lot more fuel. That's why the freeways are so convenient. There's no stopping, which means less fuel. And it's just easier on the freeway. <laughs> many people that was special I waved at him and he didn't wave back let's try waving at this guy see if he's gonna wave back all right diesel give your best smile see if we can get this guy to wave nothing zero for two coming up to a little town here in Indiana on our way to Walmart gonna see the scenic road a little bit I don't think this is Angola yet or whatever that town was that we're gonna be going to. I don't think so. It might be actually. I know, oh yeah it is, yeah. I'm three and a half kilometers from Walmart. Windows roll down. Take first exit to North Wayne Street. Roundabout? What are you talking about around? What's with all these roundabouts? Every day in a roundabout. Rotary, whatever you call them. See, look at this intersection. Works perfectly fine with traffic lights. Oh, but I get it. I see it up ahead. Wait till you see this. Once the camera gets closer, you'll see there's a big statue on top of a pole in the middle of the intersection. Let's not hit the white car truck or dash. Okay. Look at that, eh? Somebody's up on top. I wonder who that is. Who's up on top of your pole First here? Exit to North Wayne Street. This is cool. What a downtown. Oh dear, I don't think we're gonna get in here very easily. Oh, 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 nope. <laughs> Truck swing wide, it says on the left there. Don't you worry, I'll be swinging wide. Okay, how about this? We might have to push our way in here. There we go, our turn. These will get down, I need my mirror. Thank you. Good boy. Good boy. He listens very well. When I tell him to get down, he gets down like bang in an instant. Continue 2.6 kilometers to Walmart. Right, Diesel? On right. When I need my mirror, you hit the dirt. I love it. You're trained well. Good boy. So far, this is what we've got. Some healthy stuff, some not healthy stuff. Now we're looking for stuff for D's. The chew that lasts. Look at this. Yeah. D's would love that. That makes such a mess in the truck though. It'd be ridiculous for dogs, not human consumption. Because <laughs> you know someone tried to eat that. Make way too big of a mess. That should be good. My load of loot. My stash. Whatever you want to call it. We are. Oh dear. Oh. Oh. Okay. Harder than it looks pushing a cart with one hand. Diesel! Diesel, that's you! Unlock the doors, man! Unlock the doors! He's like, you got the keys. I don't got the keys. Okay, so, handy dandy keys. Yes. 
Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yep, mm-hmm. Daisy, oh, he's a, oh dear, oh dear, there goes the snake. Mr. Slithers went for a tumble. There he goes, oh look. Oh, is there a hair in here? This is what I mean, eh? Like, gotta keep up with the vacuuming. <sighs> Diesel's in his shedding season. <laughs> it's not my fault, man, I'm a dog. I got hair. Come here, Diesel, come here. You wanna see our load of loot? Yeah? Look what I got. Look you know what I got, man. Well, I got something for you in there. You wanna see it? You wanna know what it is? Should we show him? Yeah, I think so. You stay there, okay? Let's see, where is it? Where is it? Da -da 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 All the fruit is at the bottom there. I got a bunch of fresh fruit. I gotta eat that before crossing back into Canada. Oh geez, where's this little thingy? I know I bought him something. It's in here something. I love this stuff. Real pure apple juice. Like pure apple juice, not from concentrate. Pure apple juice. Okay. Where is it here? Here it is. Remember this? Remember this? What is this, Diesel? What is that? I take the plastic off, man. I don't want any plastic. Can you smell it through the plastic? Yeah, you know that's yours, don't you? Yeah, let's take the plastic off. Let's take it off. Let's get it out of here. One-handed, man. Look at that with some skill. I did that actually pretty quickly. I'm pretty impressed with myself, aren't you? Aren't you impressed with me, Diesel? <laughs> Just give me the bone, man. I don't care. Okay. Take it, man. It's yours. It's yours. Take it. Be a man. Take it. Good boy. You go do what you want with that thing. It's all yours. Every little bit of it. I don't want any of it. Be careful with that thing. Okay, now let's load all of that into there. The best part. All right, Diesel, well, we got everything put away all nice, right? Took some doing, but we found a spot for everything. And now we're gonna head on down the road. We gotta continue our quest. See how far we can get today yet. Well, we're coming near Chicago. They had the ramp to the I-80 closed, so it looks like we're gonna have to go right through Chicago by the looks of it. I think we're still in Indiana, but getting pretty close. We go through the little toll booth here. So they want our money. Gotta pay to drive through here. Green means go, come on. <laughs> I'd be worried there for a second. Usually it catches it before that. <laughs> Today. It's pretty hazy and foggy and smoggy here today, but uh, we'll see what we can do. Let's take a look at Chicago.
And we meet up with downtown traffic. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Yes. I could have stayed on the 94 on there on the left. But uh, Mandy was offering this road to me. Supposed to be faster, but that's when there isn't construction. When there's construction, messes things up a little bit, doesn't it? Should have stayed on that other highway. Should have, would have, could have, could have, would have, should have. Keep left onto I-290 West. Yeah, don't worry about it, Mandy. We're not going to get there for a while. Thanks to you and your little shortcut. I should have known that. I know how to get through here. But I looked at it, I was like, yeah, yeah, we'll try this road today. Why not? Usually it wouldn't be any slower. Usually. Another day done, Diesel. What do you think? What do you think? What are you looking at over there, man? What are you looking at? You looking at Jace? <laughs> it's still light outside. Why are we going to sleep? We're going to sleep when it's still light outside because tomorrow for us is June 21st, the longest day of the year in the northern hemisphere. It rhymed. Thank you very much. It's the top of my head. So yeah, tomorrow is the longest day of the year for me. It'll be a week after the fact for you. But uh, yeah, so the sun's gonna be up a long time. Hey, and tomorrow we'll actually be probably very close to Saskatchewan. So we'll actually get to uh, experience almost a Canadian summer solstice. Almost, I won't quite be in Canada, I don't think. But we'll get the next day, which is like the second longest day of the year. We'll be in Regina, Saskatchewan. We'll be sitting there till Monday evening, unloading, and then I have no idea what they're gonna do with me. They might send me past home. I've gotta get, like I've been saying, I got a few things I gotta get going at home. I gotta start uh, figuring out final stuff about uh, selling the house. I still haven't made my mind up completely. I'm about 90%, well, oh, let's say 80% sure that I'm gonna sell the house. Uh, but I'm gonna leave the option available to keep it. So if I decide to keep it, I don't want you guys to go saying, Trucker Josh, you said you're gonna sell your house. Because I know that's what you're going to do if I don't sell it. So I want to leave that option open in case I decide that, hey, this is just too much work or, hey, it's just not worth it to sell it. But the way it's looking right now, I'll probably sell it. Try to get a profit and uh, we'll see where life takes me from there. Exciting things. This will be my first sale of a house in my life. I bought it, what, three years ago? Two years ago? I've been living there for three years, bought it two years ago. I rented for the first year. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay guys, we're gonna call it a day here and we're gonna walk the weasel outside. We are in South Beloy at the Flying J. Where's the sign? Where's their nice little sign? Oh, okay, I guess we can't see it from here. Okay, well we can see this. That probably says Flying J on it. Does it? No, it just says trucks. So, oh, there it is, Flying J. Hi! Dang it. Wait for it, wait for it. Focus. Ah, come on, I'm gonna get this yet. Fine, there's the J. <laughs> so you believe me. We are going to continue this journey tomorrow at 4 a.m. Central Time right here on this channel. Just like every other day, I'm gonna encourage you to go down below to the description, press the show more button, a whole pile of stuff will show up, a whole bunch of links go right through it, right to the bottom. You'll find all my Facebook platforms. You'll even find the Diesel Weasels Facebook. Diesel, Lord of all weasels. 
He's a humble lord, but he is lord of all weasels. Come on, man, get up. Get up, man, be proud, man. What'd you do? He dropped his bone down there. Go get it. Go get it, man. You're the king, man. You need your bone. Get it, man, get it. Yeah, get it. I'm not gonna get it. You get it. <laughs> it's stuck, isn't it? It's stuck. Why'd you do that, man? Oh, I gotta go get it. Okay, I'll go get it. Hello? Is there a bone down there? There it is. Go get it. Go get it, Diesel. Go get it. Go get it. You couldn't get stuck. Do you get it, man? Did you get it? Do you get it? Oh, good boy. Good boy. Yeah, that was very good. Surprised you didn't get stuck, man. <laughs> That's my bone. My wing bone. <laughs> Look at this thing. Hey. Can I see it? Hey, why are you tagging it? I want to put it on your face. Look up, look up. Try it again. Come get it, Diesel. Come get it, Diesel. <laughs> he said, I don't want to put it on my face. Come <laughs> on, give it back. Give it back, man. <laughs> take it. Just take it. <laughs> Good boy. Uh, Alright guys. Don't forget about all the stuff in the description. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you tomorrow at 4 a.m. Central Time.